Okay, so hi guys, I'm back with a new video. This was requested by quite a few people, so I thought I'd do it. I've got it all set up here. I'm going to show you my um, top durable product that I recommend. And um, now for durables, obviously they're not too fussy on toys. They chew basically anything they can get their hands on. But I've just got them all on top of here, all my favourites, and I've got a few in the tank. Um, so let's get started. So the first thing that I absolutely love and they love is um hanging toys like wooden toys as you can see like they're parts of a garland so the garland is actually no longer it's just put on here now so a garland or a hanging bird toy is one of my top um no i absolutely love it because you can just get refills you don't have to buy the whole chain or nothing again and the refills you know are not a lot and the durables absolutely love them as you can see they've destroyed them another thing then is that they love our tunnels now obviously you can see that one there but i'm just going to show you the one i've already got packaged i just got a large one and a small one obviously cardboard they have to be they can't be plastic or they can be metal but you don't see really see many metal do you um but um yeah they are them and obviously there's a cheap alternative which is the tight roll tube now my durables this is like obviously a top favorite with all kinds of durables um personally they obviously they really adore these but they don't last two minutes obviously with a um if you've got um a thicker tube like the ones that are actually made like look at the thickness on there to there the one bite they've kind of like they've destroyed that within a couple of minutes obviously if you've got a load but they still go through them too quick so you don't want to just give them them um if that made any sense but i have the nice big ones so they, they kind of like to sleep in them and i have the smaller hamster this one's made for gerbils mice hamsters and other small pets Whereas that one's bigger, but I like that one in the tank. That's the one I've just shown you. And obviously the tight roll tube, like I just said. So that's another big time favourite. Another massive favourite is obviously um, wooden toy toys. Again, obviously they're all wooden. Um, now this used to be a lizard and used to have like a big back. Um, you got, they got the ladybug as well, which is actually in the tank. That you, um, I, couldn't re I didn't want to video fish it out. To show you but i've got another one in the pack ready for them and they absolutely love these they're made for hamsters gerbils guinea pigs rabbits and other small pets they're made for all kinds really but they absolutely love these they can roll about and i see them most often picking them up and actually taking them down and putting them in their nest for some reason but anyway they really like those and i got these from Viovet, and that's the only place i can really find them other people might be able to find them in local pet shops and that and i'm not too sure on the price they do range um but that's them another amazing product are the bendy bridges they called um bendy sticks or uh, st uh what they call them stickle bridges i'm not too sure what they're called but um my gerbils absolutely love these and they're really good quality wood um and you can bend them into any kind of toy like a bridge which i don't tend to have i have them off like a step um for in their level or you can have a flat like that underneath it. They're good for the nails and access obviously bark. Um so you can put like a food bowl on there or something like that. Um I have my own pets home a few um when I first had the gerbils a few months back and this was three pounds I think, which I think is actually some people think it's quite pricey, but that's actually really good, I personally think. Um I guess I've saying um, I do apologise. But you can get them from Violet, um oh you can get them all kinds of places. But they're a lot cheaper than other places. I always get barking when I'm doing a video. Um, stop saying them. You can bend them in all kinds of shapes. You can have it like that. You can, you know, you can do quite a lot with it. And you can get the bigger ones, smaller ones. Um, my rabbits and guinea pigs absolutely love the bendy bridges. And obviously the gerbils do as well because they're big chewers. And they haven't really done a lot of damage to this because they've got other toys they like, prefer to chew. Um, but but these can come in handy like for getting up to levels you know everything like that another toy i really really like they do they do play with this quite a lot because it's got a bell on there but this is just a veggie ball they use for rabbits and guinea pigs now i like to put um the bedding in there so they kind of work for the bedding um and get all the bedding out and they they love the shit uh that, the, the ball the bell on it and it's got a big gap there you can put stuff in you can get these i have my pets at home you can get them via vet and everything now these days um there's all kinds of places and you've got like a little thing so kind of you can dangle it that's just clip there because this is really old now so it's like 
falling apart but I absolutely love it and I put it in now and then because to be honest it keeps me awake quite a lot because it's quite a loud bell whereas they already got a bell toy so if they want a bell they can have a bell can't they on them another massive favourite is this oil burner this is a ceramic one with little spots on it now I've had this years I've uh, given it to the hamsters when I had the hamsters and they used to love just sitting in there munching on their food and they could put food on top now the gerbils absolutely love this I've taken it out because they've got this big massive sandbar but sometimes put sand in there and they like to put the toilet in there um, and then you can put like treats on top so they have to kind of get up and uh, have them but I had that from B&M back a few years back and I absolutely love it I want to pick up some more and I think it's really, really cute and for 99 pence as well that's a really good buy so I recommend these if you haven't got them for hamsters, mice, gerbils all kind of small rodents would absolutely love it and obviously they can go in there we then have the all time favourite is the uh, kebab. Now you can put all kinds of chews now on there. Um, there's loads and loads you can choose from. Like they've got loofah and they've got a chew on there at the moment. I don't put a lot on there because they, they just tend to chew for no reason and don't tend to use the bet, use it for anything. Um, so I just put one or two toys on there from now and then. I have lost the bottom to it because um, it wouldn't screw on properly and I'd have got fed up and I threw it. But I got I've done a little bend at the top here so they kind of like don't fall down and I've lost the other clip as well so it's just basically a stick. Um, it can it can be quite pricey I think it gives us something like three to four pound when you can actually make your own but um, obviously with metal with the gerbils they can't chew it and they just have little chews on there and another favourite that they has are these um loofah loofah chews and as you can see they've destroyed that one quite a lot um. They don't the last couple of those and they absolutely adore loofah so that's another toy i'd like to show and then um another favorite is these toys all kinds of chew toys you can buy these anyway some has got holes in it you can put them on the kebab whereas this one hasn't just there and they are absolute favorite and that's the other one there and they've got a load of these i just picked up a little handful of them so they are like a really cheap alternative but they absolutely love them. Um, one of the big time favourite these are. Whereas some small, small rodents don't tend to bother with them. My gerbils absolutely love them. We have an all time favourite. Which is an all time classic. Where these are just twigs that you can get from trees and that. But I get these from Poundland. On a massive roll of. Um, I believe it was garden fencing. And they're just natural wood. Untreated. And they just they absolutely love these. Um, and the same kind of perspective are these um, lollipop sticks now you can make stuff now with these i've just got a package here and um, these are actually seedling labels but they're lollipop sticks to me um now i just give these i poke them through the bars when they uh, like a knife and that for them to chew and they absolutely love them and they're obviously good for diy for hamsters now they don't really chew much i don't make them with gerbils because obviously if they chew the glue you don't really want them for like chewers um but you just want to give them to them as just a, just a toy to play with or you can make a toy up of it and then they're really good so they're just different types there we have another load of uh, wood chews these are like the bigger type ones which they really like as you can see they've had a good take into with that one and also like you can get them from anywhere um i had this from lubu shed so i think i've seen them in the range um then we got this what's left of two one down to chew and you have like parsley f uh, f filling in there and they absolutely love that. They like to chat that about and always end up with their nests. But they come in a pack and get them pound at uh, Poundland. You can get them pets at home. Then lastly, we have Nobby Nora's. Now the I got two of these small ones for pets at home for a pound. You can get the bigger ones for a pound. They also got food in their cages. Let me just see if I can show you one. Can see one there? That's um that's an obby nora that's, that's a bigger one. But I just pulled up one because I couldn't really find the other one that uh, didn't want to rummage through for the other ones. But they seem to really like these and obviously they're all natural so they can chew them and also these um you can obviously hang them up on a cage and i much prefer knobby noras to half the toys and they really seem to like those so that is it for me guys i hope you enjoyed this video um i hope i made it kind of clear i hope you understand what i mean by everything that i've explained and yeah this is everything just a little overview um, and I'll see you guys next time. I advise, I advise, I recommend all of the products I've shown you in this video. And I hope to see you next time. Please give a thumbs up, and I'll see you guys again. Bye, guys.